For more Magic the Gathering resources, check out my friends at paperchampion.net and Kitchen Table MTG. Okay, so we are playing Liquid Metal Destruction. I think this is keepable. Alright, so yeah, we will keep. So we'll go turn one forest, turn two cinder glade into liquid metal coating. Uh, altar of the brood, okay. I can just blow that up right away. I feel under control. Each opponent puts the top card of his or her library into okay. Alright, interesting. So I think we can just blow that up right away. Uh, well, not right away, but on turn two. So I have to get milled a little bit. All right. Oh, Isochron. Oh, okay. Well, let's go forest and pass. Okay, so turn to Isochron with Smash to Smithereens. Then just start blowing up his artifacts, I guess. Alter the Brood. Okay, I got to mill a card. Sure. Okay. Faceless looting, so opponent's looking for something. Alright. So, reforge the soul. This goes to their hand, then draws seven cards. Oh, I, I'm so glad he did not cast that. Is this some form of mill? Interesting. A red blue mill. Okay. Well, let's go turn to um, Mountain and tap, tap, and we'll go Isochron. Okay, so Isochron Scepter, okay. Uh, targeting Smash to Smithereens, okay. And pass. So next turn, I'll just play out, I'll just actually play out Isochron and Tap that, tap Isochron to destroy Altar of the Brood. Then I'll start blowing up his lands. Okay. Alright, so Altar of the Brood's gonna go. That's kind of bothering me a lot, but still, he hasn't milled me for too much yet. Oh, Destructive Revelry. Okay. Do two damage to. Alright, so let's go play Cinderglade. We will pay two, tap Isochron Scepter. Okay, so we will cast Smash the Smithereens on the Altar of the Brood. Okay, and go. Alright, so that's okay. Okay, Dictate of Crufix. Now, Smash the Smithereens is only for Artifact, but Destructive Revelry can take care of that Crufix. Can take care of the Dictate of Crufix, alright. So next turn, I will play Liquid Metal Coating and Destructive Revelry. All right. Okay, so. Okay, I'll draw an additional card. Smash the Smithereens. All right, well, let's go play the Forest out, and we will go red, green. Destroy Target Enchantment, Dictate of Crufix. Okay, tap, tap for liquid metal coating. Okay, and go. All right, so I pretty much can destroy one thing pretty much every turn. All right, so let's see, does my opponent have anything else in his hand? Okay, so an island. Okay, very well. So tapping for four, traumatized. Puts the top half as a library rounded down. Ooh. That hurts. All right, well, it is what it is. I can't do anything about that. Okay, and go. Forest. We will make a liquid metal coating on, let's go red, take him off of red mana. Okay, and play Manic Vandal. Okay, so destroy his mountain. Okay, so let's see if, what, if my opponent can recover from this after st starting to blow up his... He's still got a lot of mana. Four mana is quite a bit. So still has a land. Okay, land might be a dead draw for him though. Let's see, Dream Twist. Okay, so three cards. Not a lot. 
and I can start swinging next turn. Okay, think twice, draw a card, okay. So, all right, he's doing pretty well. 16 still a lot to go though. All right, Dream Twist with flashback, okay. Down to 13. All right, so let's go uh, Forest. And we will tap Liquid Metal Coating, um, targeting an island. Okay, and go tap Isochron, pay two. Okay, so smash the smithereens, targeting his island. Okay, we'll swing with the Vandal. Okay, and see how we do. Okay, so what's my opponent gonna play? So, let's see, think twice, draw a card, okay. So can he mill me for 12 before I take him down to zero life while I also have Faithless Looting? Okay, draw two cards, discard two cards. Okay, let's see how he does with that. He's tapped out. I'm going to try and still take out his red mana. Okay, Faithless Looting, Exiles, all right. Ho oh, ho! Okay. Uh, Horde Smelter Dragon flying. Destroy target artifact. It's X or X is. All right. Well, let's let's get that guy out. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. For Horde Smelter Dragon. Paying green. Oh, did I not get enough red? Okay. So cancel. Okay, so untap. Okay, tap for red. Horde Smelter Dragon. All right, that's fine. And then that's going to pretty much close out the game next turn unless he does something about it. Okay, so I can pretty much kill him next turn. Well, almost. All right, so Jace's Phantasm, that's fine. He's got another 5-5 of his own. Another Phantasm. Okay. That's pretty much not going to help that much. Okay. Mirror Land Shaper is pretty good. Alright. Well, let's go Liquid Metal Coating on Jace's Phantasm. Okay. And we will uh, pay 4 destroy this artifact gives me becomes a six five okay and that's actually okay I'll just wait hmm do I trade or do I wait I'll just wait I don't think that my opponent can mill me for ten unless they get super lucky it, especially because they only have one card here or they only have one card on their draw reforge the soul Play discards with your hand and draw seven cards. Ooh, that hurts. Okay, that's okay though. So I still have three cards. Okay. Oh, Splinter would have been so nice. Although Splinter is still pretty nice. But Dream Twist. Oh, he got me. All right, good game to my opponent. All right. That was pretty good. Now, if I had picked up Splinter earlier, that would have been a lot better, but we'll see what happens here. Okay, so let's see. I don't think anything is really going to help me too much here. He's playing just all basics. Um, yeah, I don't think that anything's going to help me here. <laughs> My opponent says it's the first time he's won with this deck. I'm not sure if I should be insulted or, or, you know, maybe it's just learning to play it. All right, so yes, I'd like to play first. Okay, I hope I didn't accidentally play, pick no there. Um, I think I'm gonna mulligan. Liquid metal coating. 
All right, I'll keep this. Especially because I get to go on the draw. Uh, yeah, I can do this. Top of your... Okay, so I will take a... Did I accidentally pick no? I hope not. No, I'm on my untap face. Okay, good. All right. So I'm going to go uh, rootbound Craig. I have no turn one play anyway, so that's not a big deal. But I've got my mana online pretty much. Okay, so I can start blowing up my opponent's lands. I gotta keep him off of uh, gotta keep him off of blue. Okay, blue's his main color. So island. Okay, alter the brood. That's fine. So next turn I can play smash to well. Yeah, let's go ancient grudge on my opponent. Okay, so. Okay, okay, and Mountain, and let's just go um, Ancient Grudge. Okay, so I'll blow up that altar. Okay, so then, next turn I can get my Liquid Metal Coating out, tap it. If I get a, well, hopefully I pick up another land. Then I can get Liquid Metal Coda, you know, tap it, can't play Ancient, Ancient Grudge, destroy his island. Alright, so keep him off of islands all the time. Okay, Faithless Looting, can't really do much with that, or against that. Okay, but keeping him off of blue mana is going to be helpful. Okay, so, what does my opponent have? Does he have a one mana card? Maybe, yeah, Dream Twist, okay. Ugh, oh, milled an Isochron Scepter, that hurt a lot. Okay, land, land shaper, not so good, but all right, well, let's get out Liquid Metal Coating. We start the destruction next turn. Okay, so go. All right, so next turn, I get Liquid Metal Coating out, blow up his land, and then uh, make it just basically got to keep him off of his land now. I might want to keep him off of red uh, It's tough because red has all the artifact destruction. And he may have boarded some in um, Alter the brood again, okay That's okay if I get in hopefully I get another uh, Land here if I get another land I'm fine No land all right, so what do I do? Let's go tap this. I don't really care about this one one just yet. Let's take off his... Let's take away his blue mana. And we will go smash the smithereens. Okay. And go. I can take one damage from my opponent. Okay, so alter the brood. Always yield. Okay see my graveyard okay so I've still got I've got two ancient grudges in my graveyard which is pretty good all right so I can hopefully pick up another land shortly here all right so I could just um, go oh I was gonna say ancient grudge and then um, let's see oh the mill actions oh he's doing five damage okay well I guess I got to get rid of that Okay, Cinderglade, tapped, not so good. All right, well, let's go um, Liquid Metal Coating on Jace's Phantasm, then we will pay a green, and flashback Ancient Grudge, destroying, okay, destroying Jace's Phantasm. Okay, and go. Okay, so I can also flash back the other Ancient Grudge uh, next turn, or if I can, I can also just destroy his mountain, take him off of, okay, or get him off of, start getting him off of blue mana. Okay, so opponent has Faithless Looting. Okay, so mill me for one, fine. Okay. Manic Vandal. Okay, well, let's go turn that forest, or turn that mountain, into an artifact. 
Manic Vandal comes in, destroy target artifact. Okay, so I'll blow up his lands. Okay, I can deal with the one mana at a time damage, but like, like the one mill at a time. But dealing with like, you know, his mass mill spells is going to be really tough. Okay, so think twice, gets a card. Okay, he's tapped out. Good, nothing. That's nice. Okay, so let's go um, tap and target another island. Okay, Manic Vandal again. Okay, blowing up island again. All right, so we're, I think we're doing okay. Swing for two. Okay, there's nothing else I can do this turn. I still have an Ancient Grudge in the graveyard, so I can still flash that back. I'll blow up his other island next turn. So I keep him keep keep him off of blue mana. Okay, another altar, that's fine. Okay. I think I'm in pretty good shape. Yeah, okay, so let's go. Um hmm, hmm. Well let's tap, take away his island. Okay, so we will go tap for green, cast Ancient Grudge against that island, keep him off of blue mana. All right, and go red, red, smash the smithereens on his altar. Okay, swing for four. All right, so we're doing pretty good. Although I'm kind of out of gas, but I can pick up another Ancient Stirring, uh, play Ancient Stirrings and pick up another land or Isochron. Liquid Metal Coating is pretty good, but doesn't really help me right now. Okay, so let's go Ancient Stirrings. <laughs> another Liquid Metal Coating. All right, so let's pick up a, a Mountain. Okay, and any order is fine. I can't cast Horde Smelter Dragon yet. Okay, but we will, well, might as well play out a, let's play out a creature, I guess. And just start adding to our beats. Okay, so Manic Vandal doing four. I'm going for a lethal next turn. My opponent's down to one mana. One red mana too. All right, so does he get anything? No, all right, so we will just swing, I suppose. Okay, so we're just going for the attack. Okay, I don't have any any destruction left. And I can't cast the Horde Smelter Dragon just yet. <laughs> Alright. Is my opponent going to concede? Okay. I'm not sure what he's doing here, but... Alright, we'll see what, what's going on. Maybe he's just typing. All right, so I, the thing with this deck is that when it goes off, it's actually really, really good. But when it doesn't, it just really is hard to deal with. Like, it's just, you know, you just get either killed really fast or you win really fast. Like, my matches in this with this deck have been, um, have been pretty sweet, so... Oh, okay. Okay, we're back with match three. We've got the liquid metal coating and splinter. I really, ho I gotta keep this, even though it's a one lander or two. Well, it's two lander. That's good. I yeah, I can play this. So let's keep. I really want to get that splinter combo off. That's gonna be amazing if I can do it. So I can go turn one mountain voltaic key, serum visions. Okay, so opponent's looking for something. Okay, just uh, draw a card, scry two, put one on the top, one on the bottom. All right, so let's go turn one, mountain, tap, voltaic key. Turn two, we'll do root, uh, rootbound crag into liquid metal coating, then to destructive revelry, taking away his uh, islands again. All right, so... If we can get my opponent off of his islands, I think we'll be okay. So just draw two cards, discard two cards. So he's just drawing like crazy. Looking for something. Okay, so traumatize. Man, 
some of those mill carts are just deadly. All right, so smash the smithereens is pretty good. Let's go rootbound Craig. Tap and tap for liquid metal coating. Okay, and next turn we can start blowing stuff up. Okay, I'm gonna leave the destructive revelry up because if he manages to drop a uh, dictate of crew fix, then I can use that to blow it up. Okay, so let's go tap target island. Okay, and smash the smithereens on the island. Okay, and I wish I had the mana to cast a uh, splinter on that. That'd be so sweet. Just basically take away all of his islands. <laughs> um, that'd be so harsh. Um, so, come on, lands. Isochron. All right, well, let's pay two. And we'll get an Isochron Scepter with Destructive Revelry on it. Okay, so this way I can blow up uh, a land or an enchantment every turn. Okay, so I will have to leave it though for now. All right, so a little bit slower. Hopefully he does not have another island. Discards his hand. Oh, no, lost my splinter. That's okay. This actually probably helps me. Okay, so. All right. Um, yeah, it's probably, it actually helps a little bit here. Especially two liquid metal coatings now. I can start destroying more stuff. All right. Ral Zarek. That's an interesting card. Interesting. Okay. Faithless looting again. Now I'm going to take him off of, um, yeah, I'll be able to take him off of his blue mana next turn. So, all right. I think, I, like I said, this, uh, his, this deck is, uh, this dictate of Krufix mill deck is actually, um, pretty deadly. So I just got to keep him off of the blue mana. Okay. So we will go uh, rootbound Craig again. Tap, uh, actually tap, target his island. Tap and tap, paying. Okay, and we'll destructive revelry, blow up his land and do two damage to him. All right. So next turn, what do we do? Um, I guess we can blow it up and, well, I guess yeah, if we don't have enough mana to do much else, so just keep taking him off his blue mana. Okay. So Faithless looting again, looking for something. Okay. Discards think twice, discards dream twist. All right. Come on, Splinter. Come on, Splinter. <laughs> if I draw a Splinter here, it'll be amazing. Splinter. Oh, Ancient Stirrings. Okay, well, we will tap this. Pay to um, destroy target artifact. Oh, no. No. Oh, totally misplayed that. All right. We'll have to go with our... Luckily, I didn't have to destroy my own artifact. All right, so luckily, and luckily I had smelt in the grit in my hand. Oh, awful. I think I forgot to play a land there, too. God, that's so awful. Okay, so alter the brood. I mill one. All right. So opponent faithless looting. He's looking for something. Looking pretty hard. Opponent's got a ton of cards in his graveyard here. Okay. Isochron again. Um, yeah, it could be okay. Let's go mountain. Tap, tap for Isochron. Okay. Okay, targeting Smash the Smithereens. Okay, we will tap his... Hmm. Tap his red mana. Okay, just want to get rid of him, take him off mana. Okay, blow up an artifact. Okay, and go. 
Okay, so now I can blow up two things every turn. Yeah, so I can tap, turn something into an artifact, pay one, untap, turn something else into an artifact. Then I can still pay two and two for the two isochrons and basically blow up two things every turn. So I can get them down to one mana next turn. So uh, it's not looking good for them. But, alright. Okay. Alright, so, yeah, my opponent has commented that yeah, he can't play, so it's really boring, basically, because I'm locking him out. That's the problem with this kind of deck. I mean, it's good that you can lock your opponent out, but, you know, um, you know, if you're trying to play for fun, you know, then your opponent's not going to have any fun playing against you. So, anyways, that's the match. Hope you liked it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.